Have you ever paused to ponder the profound power of solitude? The art of being alone, not in loneliness, but in quiet contemplation, can be a source of rejuvenation and balance. It's in these moments of tranquility that the whispers of wisdom can be heard the clearest. In the whirlwind of our daily routines, we often get caught up in the rush, the hustle, and the constant chase. Appointments, deadlines, commitments, they all vie for our attention, leaving us little room to breathe, let alone think. But amidst this chaos, a gentle voice calls us, inviting us to take a break, to rest, and to reconnect with our inner selves. Imagine this, in a world that never sleeps, you find a sanctuary of silence, a place where time slows down, where the mind finds peace and the soul rejuvenation. This is not a physical place, but an intimate space within you, a sacred meeting point between you and the divine. In this place, you're not alone. You're in the company of the most compassionate listener, the most understanding teacher, the most loving guide, the Lord. He invites you to come into his presence, to communicate, to share, and to listen. He offers you a haven of rest and healing, of love and light. As you spend time in this divine communion, you'll find yourself refreshed and renewed. Your strength is replenished your spirit uplifted. You'll discover the wisdom to navigate your day, the courage to face your challenges, the patience to endure your trials, and the peace to calm your storms. In conclusion, the essence of our message is simple yet profound. Take time for yourself, not just to rest your body, but to renew your spirit, to commune with the divine, to listen to his wisdom, to receive his love. For those who wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. Remember, in the midst of your busyness and commitments, there is always room for a moment of solitude, a moment to be with the Lord. A moment to be simply you.